Installing GitAhead is pretty straightforward. Open your browser and go to GitAhead.com. Scroll down until you find the big blue download button. GitAhead is truly cross-platform and should work with most any recent operating system. I'll select Windows 10. Run the installer as soon as it finishes downloading. From here you can pretty much just follow the wizard. I'll click Next. I'll agree to the terms of service. I'll pick where I want my installation folder to go. And I'll create a shortcut for my start menu. The installer should handle the rest from here on out. Looks like we're finished. I'll leave this box ticked so we can go ahead and run git ahead. The first time through, you should see a window to pick a theme. The native theme tries to mimic the style and system colors of whatever platform you're using. I prefer this theme on Mac or Linux. The dark theme reduces eye strain and is optimal for nighttime viewing. I personally prefer this theme on Windows. I suggest you try both. You can always change this setting later. In fact, let me show you how to do that now. I'll quickly open an existing repository. I'll come up here to the main menu. I'll click Tools, Options. I'll click on the window panel. And here I can change the theme. Default. I'll have to restart for this change to take effect. That concludes this tutorial. Next up, you might find these videos helpful.